My name is uh, Tom Kellerman, officially Thomas Kellerman. Uh, I came to Australia in 1947. Uh, I was sponsored to come here by the Australian Jewish Welfare Guardian Society. I was the first uh, migrant boy, young boy. I was uh, uh, 17 at the time when I came here. and. Uh, uh, I was working with the Australian Jewish Welfare Society for a number of years. Then I went into commercial practice uh, as an accountant, mostly um, not um, self-employed, working for accountants, but for working for commercial firms. And uh, then in the course of my activities, uh, I uh, came into contact with members of Bene Brith and um, I was asked to join uh, quite late in life uh, uh, that was uh, probably in 1986 when I joined uh, with uh, um, uh, the uh, at that time they were forming a new unit on the North Shore called Kadima unit and I was one of the foundation members as well uh, I was very much interested in, in uh, social uh, justice and various other uh, problems that uh, can arise in a community with, with or without, with, the, with or within the Jewish community. And uh, uh, so uh, I <clears throat> became interested in, in Bernie Brit and eventually joined up. Uh, however, uh, after a couple of years, I found that there was something missing. Uh, I found that the Kadima unit was very interested in charity work, very interested in social activities, but I mistook the need to work in, in a social justice area. 88 or 89, I, we formed the, we became formed a new unit, Alpha Dreyfus Anti-Defamation Unit, and Paul Herschel became the president and I was the vice president, and we had a small executive, and <coughs> um, we uh, started the work of anti-defamation. What uh, we, we found uh, that uh, uh, there were a, a lot of areas where the New South Wales Jewish Board of Deputies wasn't involved. One of them was ethnic media monitoring. They did have some ethnic uh, media monitoring, but we wanted to do it on, on a much more intensive scale and larger scale than they were doing it. Uh, the reason for uh, uh, investigating and monitoring ethnic broadcasting was because there were a number of ethnic newspapers uh, in, who expressed uh, anti-Semitic views and also, of course, anti-Israeli views. But it was a, um, a lot of the um, um, this activity was centered on Jewish people living in Australia, anti-Semitic, uh, and sometimes the anti-Semitism was straightforward. Sometimes the anti-Semitism was sort of put in a form which you could guess that it, they were referring to the Jews, but if you read it and you were an innocent person, you wouldn't know that. When I became president, I particularly pushed the issues of ethnic monitoring to improve it, to get uh, as, as many uh, spe uh, speakers or translators uh, on my side, together with my executive, and um, uh, also the, uh, that was more important is the, uh, at that time, we, uh, Paul Herschel and myself, we, and also his wife, Elizabeth Herschel, we got in, oh yes, and I must mention also Judy Shapira. We got involved with uh, forming uh, a new, improved Holocaust kit for the teachers in New South Wales. And eventually this uh, Holocaust kit for the teachers was so successful that in Brisbane they asked for it. So we used to send copies of these Holocaust kits to be distributed to some school, not as many as in New South Wales, in Queensland. Uh, when I look back uh, uh, at uh, the time, we felt that 
very, it was a, um, a, a, a very necessary organization. First of all, it, uh, it brought together people of different back Jewish backgrounds, the re religious, ultra-religious, the, the uh, progressive, and the ones who were uh, not practicing Jews, but they called themselves ethnically Jewish. So all these people, they, they, they formed uh, um, a, um, a group of people that um, um, were um, uh, really uh, interested uh, they were interested in, in lectures, they were interested in music, they were interested in many other activities, and eventually some of them also became friends of our ADU. So very often we had people who were secondary members, who were already members of other lodges and units, and they came to us as well. 